Hey guys, it's John from Mission Lean. I'm here to give you an amazing HIIT workout routine that you can do anywhere, anytime without any equipment necessary. The beauty of HIIT interval training is that you don't need much time and you can get in an incredible workout in 20 to 30 minutes. And that's the HIIT workouts are one of the mainstays of the Mission Lean app and we provide hundreds of on-demand workouts. So if you haven't downloaded the app already, check it out and an, an incredible uh, tool to sticking with a consistent HIIT training is to have those accessible workouts, a, a, a library of many workouts with great variety so your training never gets boring. Now, one thing I wanna mention, the key to a great HIIT workout session is to combine high intensity aerobic moves with more strength-based body weight moves that you can transition to that will give you a little bit of a breather in between the very aerobically intense moves. And so if you structure a workout where you move from one aerobically intense move to uh, a strength-based body weight move that's not as aerobically intense, you give yourself a breather and you can last longer in these intervals and get, get the most out of your body. And that's, that's how we structure the workouts on, on the Mission Lean app and how, how you can really maximize your high intensity interval training. So check out the workout to follow. Again, limit the rest time between moves because that's how you're going to get your heart rate up and burn the maximum amount of fat. Subscribe to our YouTube channel below if you haven't already and give us the like on the video if, if you're doing the workout and, and you're enjoying it. So check it out, get in the workouts, get in the consistency and let's do this. Mission Lean. Jump from one side of the mat to the other, bending on each jump to touch the ground with your hand. Explode from one jump right into the next as there should be no waiting between jumps. Bend with your knees and not your back. Get onto the mat on your back and put your hands behind your head as you lift your feet off the ground. Alternate touching one elbow to the opposite knee and then repeat on the other side. Feel the burn in your abs as you move swiftly from one side to the other. Keep the movement continuous as you begin to feel a great burn in the abs and obliques. Put your hands behind your back and turn 45 degrees for a lunge. Get your back leg as close to the ground as possible. Return to the starting position and repeat on the other side. Feel the burn in the quad and hamstrings. Get on all fours with your arms extended. Keep your core engaged as you lift one arm up and touch the opposite shoulder. Move from one touch right into the next at a good rhythm. Keep your back straight and focus on keeping your movement controlled. Bring one foot onto the mat, followed by the next foot, and then the first foot back behind the mat, again followed by the trailing foot. Each touch of the feet should be quick, and you want to find the coordination so that you're moving swiftly between the mat and ground. Footwork is everything in this exercise. Lay on your back and put your hands behind your butt. Lift your legs up off the ground and start with one leg higher than the other, alternating the height of each leg above one another. Don't allow your feet to touch the ground at all during this exercise, but bring them low to the ground with each repetition. Make sure not to lift your legs too high either, as the movement should be compact, controlled, and completed at a good pace.